Yay, it's snowing. It is snowing out here in the forest. Hey everybody, what's up? Epic Kid here. And uh, today I'm going to be viewing the More Furnaces mod, as you could probably tell by the title. Uh, basically what the More Furnaces mod is, is it adds in more furnaces. Uh, also tell from the title. So the first furnace we have here is the regular furnace, and I think you know how to craft it. Like that. You get a furnace. Two slots and you cook stuff. Relatively slow. See, like that. Then the next furnace is the tier up from this furnace. This is how you craft it. It's an iron furnace. You wrap iron around a regular furnace, like this. And um, then it cooks a little bit faster. And you can, and it has four sl slots, as you see. So it, it cooks faster. And it has four slots. So I guess it's a, it's a nice tier up from the regular furnace. The next furnace is the gold furnace. And, um, the gold furnace is also another tier up from this. And you wrap gold around an iron furnace, and you give it, get a gold furnace. And then this one has four slots, and it cooks way faster. See? See how fast it's going when all things are cooking? So that's that. It cooks pretty fast. It's nice. So, um, it's a gold furnace. Kind of expensive, but gold. Yeah. And then the next furnace is the obsidian furnace. I'm gonna grab some beef for this one. So the obsidian furnace has two slots and two output slots, and it has two cooking slots as well. So if we were to put two there, two beef there, and two co pork here, it'd cook them separately, but kind of slowly. <laughs> kind of like a regular furnace, but I get steak down here, and pork down here, so that's the obsidian furnace. And you craft it by putting obsidian around a, an iron furnace. And then the next one that kind of goes with the obsidian furnace is the netherrack furnace. Um, you craft it by putting netherrack around a regular furnace. So you need to go to the nether for that. And um, the way it works is um, you to cook things, you put that in there, and you have to light it on fire. So you'd get like a flint and steel, light it on fire, and it would start cooking the pork really slowly. So, um, yeah. So those are all the furnaces, and then for the end of this mod showcase, I'm gonna do a lucky block. So, let's see how this goes. Alright guys, it's time for the lucky part. Oh, that frame rate lag. One second. Alright, so time for the lucky block part. Don't know what's up with the frames. Um, fast, off, oh well. Uh, alright, so let's go. Um, thanks. <laughs> Yay, peaceful. Burn. Alright, that one. Nether star. Yeah, that's actually really good. Okay. Ooh, lucky bow and arrows. Yay. Um, oh god, rainbow sheep. And potions. All very. We got so much pork. Alrighty. Next one. Oh, that's bad. Um, I wonder if this is possible. Is it breaking? All I know is it takes like five times more time to break things underwater. I don't want to stop breaking it. I'm peaceful. Come on, I can see the lines. Come on, come on, come on, come on, break it, break it, break it, break it, break it. Dang it! Dang it. Hacks. I call hack. And you, I call like Dang it, alright, we lost all of our stuff completely. Is it gone? Not all of it, but. Yeah. Screw the world. Oh, there, there, that works. <laughs> How many times have I died? Twice? There's no way I'm gonna get through this thing. I barely even got through the first. Characters. Ooh, lucky boat. Ooh, TNT. Ooh, cake. 
Ooh, spongy jump. Um, a fan. Help, please. Uh, arrows, arrows. Lucky bow. Where'd my lucky bow go? Some tools. An axe. I can come with an axe. Come here, giant. Die. Die, you giant pain. Die. Oh, god dang it. Alright, guys. Well, that was uh, the furnaces mod. And the lucky block mod. Um. <laughs> I guess thank you for watching. I'm gonna be uploading more videos with my friends and better quality soon, so uh, stay tuned. And uh, thank you all. Bye.